Welcome to the webbikeworld.com quick video tour of the HJC IS16 motorcycle helmet. Please visit webbikeworld.com for the full detailed review and photos of this helmet and many more. The new IS16, the IS Max flip up we reviewed recently, and the IS33 jet styled helmet were released by HJC at the Dealer Expo in February of 2009 to fit just under their FS series of helmets, which are at the top of their product lineup. This IS-16 in the anthracite metallic solid color has an excellent surface finish, and it has a decent clear coat that should give long service without problems. HJC has given the IS helmets an updated shell shape, and the IS-16 looks modern and sleek with a contour along the side leading back from the side chin vents. The face shield has a lock on the side, but the visor has only three positions, closed, half open, and fully open. It can be cracked open with some effort, but it would be better if it had a small first opening for defogging or ventilation. The IS-16 has an internal sun visor, but it operates with HJC's complicated spring-loaded system that only allows three positions, fully raised, about three-quarters of the way down, and fully lowered. We'd much prefer that the visor used a simpler friction system with a lever on the side so that it could be placed in any position. To raise the sun visor, the button on the top has to be pushed, a spring pops it back up into the fully raised position. So you can't just raise the visor slightly, you have to press the button, which springs the visor all the way back up, then you have to move the visor back down again. That's really too complicated, and you can't adjust the positioning to anything other than one of the three settings. The chin vent works well on the IS-16, but the cover feels slightly flimsy, and the little tab on top feels like it will probably break off. It does provide good airflow, and there are vents through the chin bar and also at the top of the chin bar and back of the visor. The top vents on the helmet work independently, and they flow a small amount of air, but they also add a significant amount of whistling noise to the helmet. The IS-16 has a large chin spoiler, which helps reduce noise from underneath, and it focuses the airflow inside, and the liner is well made and comfortable. The chin strap uses the double D-ring system. The IS-16 is DOT approved only when sold in North America, and the polycarbonate shell feels sturdy with little flex. Overall, this is a solid helmet at a relatively low price, about $30 less than HJC's FS series of helmets. So that's the webbikeworld.com quick video tour of the HJC IS-16 motorcycle helmet. Be sure to visit webbikeworld.com for the detailed review and more photos of this helmet, and for over 750 detailed motorcycle product reviews and lots of information. Thanks for watching.